Now, in terms of pros and cons, we'll start with the pros. I think the pros of studying BioE is that you do have diverse career opportunities, even though they're funneled into a handful of different fields. You can work in software if you study bioengineering. You can work in uh, for a hardware company. You can work for uh, a medical. You can work for a hospital system. You can do service. You can do design. You can do development. You can work in pharma or medical devices. You can be doing testing. There is a lot of things that you can do with with bioengineering in biotech, healthcare, academia, pharma, medical devices. I think what I personally really enjoyed, and I think we are going to be moving towards a more generalist kind of economy where the people that know how to put things to my podcast Let's Combinate is about combining medical devices and pharma. But what I really like to do behind it is looking at other areas of opportunities. And sometimes the most elegant and simple solutions is just to take two things and put them together. And so the interdisciplinary the interdisciplinary culture that you see in bioengineering more than other majors, I think is really great and something that I personally really enjoyed. There is high demand in the sectors that we talked about. There's strong earning potential. You can do graduate study. And it's one of those majors that if you do plan on going to, whether it's medical school, pharmacy school, PA school, dentistry, there is this concept of the innovator physician, the physician scientist who can not only diagnose and treat, but can also develop the tools of the trade and uh, that in a few different, a few areas, particularly around surgery. And, but you see it really across the board where you have physicians who are also folks who can develop products. One thing is that the global applicability. And I think that a lot of times like civil, it's hard to be, uh, In my experience, a lot of the stuff that's done in the U.S. is done under local, state, federal municipalities. There's a lot of tie with the government, whereas with medical devices and pharma, most of the companies are global. So you get that perspective a little bit more. Now, some of the cons of biomedical engineering, the first one is just around engineering in general is obviously there's high academic demand, not an easy major. I experienced this personally. I know some others uh, have as well. But the entry level positions may require you to get additional certifications, try and find internships or have advanced degrees. So I do think that getting that after you get your first role, it's pretty much smooth sailing and you can find a pretty solid career in with bioengineering as your major. But getting that first one, I have found pretty difficult. You have less defined of a career path. Uh, If you look at civil engineering, I like to think of it as the science of building, so to speak, those types of industries like civil, they have very defined career paths. They have certifications that have been around for literally decades. Whereas a lot of that is newer to folks in medical devices and pharma. And there's a good to that and a negative to that if you're really looking for something that has a very defined career path. It's highly regulated, which I think surprises people. For me, at least when I came into medical devices, that was my first job out of college. I was like, I'm going to cure cancer. I'm going to help develop the next cutting edge medical device. And it was just like slog of development, how slow it is. And I, I've personally learned to love that. But if you're not going to be excited about getting into a, a highly regulated industry, it's just a consideration that you need to have going into it. That's how it's going to be. And it's probably going to be, it's probably, while there is intensity behind the work, the advancement of programs from concept to launch, those timeframes are typically a lot longer than say a consumer product or an electronic. And so those are the cons as far as choosing bioengineering.